Hi, and welcome to the May <laughs> Geek Fuel unboxing. It's delayed. They shipped it late. Uh, supposedly it's their heaviest box. It's got some good weight to it. Um, so let's see what's in it. Yep, jumping out at me. Looks like this slid a little bit. Uh, it's the game download. Weapon Weaponographist. Weaponographist. Okay. Uh, sort the T. Okay. Uh, high speed, top down dungeon crawling arena combat game. Uh, Ten dollar rally. Hmm. So it could be a good one. Let's see what else we got in here? Hold the box at an angle so the stuff is sliding out on me here. Okay. This must be the Uncharted item. Nice. Okay, we have Uncharted comp, uh, concept art, I'm assuming. Or at least pictures from Uncharted. My wife just got me a new uh, PS3. Got the Uncharted games one through three. Haven't played them much, but gameplay looks pretty good. The cut scenes are like mute movie quality, so I hear a lot of people look forward to Uncharted 4. I'll probably be one of them. Um, but let's see what else we have in here. Got little oop, gotta open this. Hashtag Deadpool. Tiny little Deadpool thing. It is usually called a monitor sitter from the opening scene of Deadpool where he's sitting on the bridge. If you have not seen the movie and you are not a little kid, please go see it. It is very funny. If you are a little kid, I'm sorry, but you cannot see that movie. That is rated R for a reason. It is not appropriate for children. It is Deadpool. Deadpool is not usually appropriate for children. Kind of in the name, Deadpool. Um, there we go. Ooh. Nice heavy glass. Geek Fuel, I think I've heard the robot's name is Fuel or Fuely. I'm not sure what the exact name for the robot is. Um, Geek Fuel, if you give us a heads up on that. Maybe it was in one of the earlier crates. This looks pretty cool. Oh, nice. On the forest, the wall. This is actually really nice. Instead of just doing the usual, looks like it was covering the t-shirt, it is a map of Westeros and the Free Cities. If you're not aware, this is from the show Game of Thrones. It's kind of a... It's a, on HBO, so it's pretty graphic, but it's a kind of, uh, I guess, Lord of the Rings kind of mythology. It's a pretty good show. I like it. I'm going to go ahead and jump right to the shirt. Leicester Estates, also from Game of Thrones. Tyron's Vineyard. And that is actually not a black shirt. Nice. All right. Let's see. If you watch the show, you know Tyron is the dwarf, played by one of my favorite actors, honestly, uh, Peter Dinklage. Or, I'm sure I'm butchering his last name. If he ever sees this, I apologize, sir. You are a great actor. Huge fan of you. Um, he was in, let me think, what else have I seen him in? He was in Knights of Bad Astem on Netflix. It's... Pretty funny movie if you want to kill about two hours of goofy stoner humor. Uh, he was also in Pixels. That was a good family-friendly movie. Came out just a little bit ago. He was the the guy competing against, I believe it was Kevin James. I think he was the one that... He's the guy with the glasses. Alright, so we got a bunch more goodies in here. We got a nice little that bag of 
Scarlet bag holding a treasure chest. Which is actually a really nice little chest here. The camera will focus. Nice little latch. It is actually wood. It is nailed and stapled together. This is actually a wood chest. That's really nice. And it contains... Oh! Oh, hey. Alright, I'll pull the foam out before, but... Yeah. It is the ring. Um, Drake. Drake's ring from Antarctic Games. He wears this on his neck around a leg here. Just like you would see here. And it's a good size. Let's see. Yep, it fits. <laughs> Uh, I'll probably keep this on this keep this for display purposes, but that's actually a really nice item. Um, Geek Fuel. Since I've started getting it, which was I think I started the December crate. My parents got me a subscription for Geek Fuel. That's the first one I tried. Um, I've not been disappointed. They have been very consistently good. Um, Unlike some of the competition, which has been going way downhill. Alright, we have... <laughs> Geek Fuel Limited Edition. If you're wondering what he was holding in that little figure, he is holding this. Actually, if I remember correctly, he was holding one that said, uh, My name is Francis. Instead of ouchie, because he's looking for Francis. Um, another Deadpool item, limited edition Geek Fuel. So that's pretty cool. Let's see. This downloadable game. There's a shirt on the back here. On Tower 4, refueling pint. Uh, heat waves are just around the corner. Nothing says summer like a cold pint of your favorite beverage. Perfect for whatever fuels you. Um, true for most people. I'm a coffee guy myself, so I really wouldn't suggest putting coffee in a pint glass. That just seems dangerous. Sir Francis Drake's Lost Ring. Okay, so it's Sir Francis Drake, who's a famous explorer. If you don't know who Sir Francis Drake is, just look him up. He's just some pretty cool things. Uh, we propose you join us on a treasure hunt. The custom ring uncovered in the sands of a lost temple is the perfect addition to any adventurer's bounty. Deadpool monitor mate. Uh, that one's exclusive. Great things come in small packages, and this exclusive Deadpool monitor mate is no exception. Hang out with the Merc with the mouth at your desk, and add all crazy to your day. It's like they know me. I'm already crazy. Ah. Oh. And if you're one of these lucky people, I know it's not nice to say, but I hate you because I never win this stuff. Looks like some people got randomly inserted the Blu-ray DVD and digital HD copy Deadpool movies, which, nope, did not get. That stinks. Nice. And they got, looks like they're going to have some information about uh, X-Men. Anyway. $5 discount towards the purchase of Deadpool and Blu-ray DVD. Please go to foxconnect.com and use Geek Fuel. Oh, hey, anyone who hasn't had the Geek Fuel DVD yet, here's a $5 coupon. Always happy to share that stuff. All right. A little blurb about Uncharted. Came out on May 10th. Uh, cosplay feature is someone whose name I'm not even going to try to pronounce. Yeah. Her. Uh, X-Men Apocalypse. The characters we can't wait to see. Apocalypse, Nightcrawler, Psylocke, and Jubilee. Yes, there is actually Jubilee in the movie. She's the chick in the red trench coat. Shoots fireworks. I'm assuming they're probably going to beef her up from the old comics. Um, uh, 
Nope. She's still shooting pyrotechnics. <laughs> uh, top 10 archive. Your thoughts become a list of reality. Uh, apparently it's a YouTube channel. Top 10 archive. Looks like they have like top 10 mythological things. Might have to check that out. Uh, Gamer Corner. Uh, Total War Warhammer for Steam. Doom for PC. Go figure. Uncharted 4 for PS4. Battleborn for the Xbox One. And the Wii U gets the Book of Unwritten Tales 2. Those are the recommended games this month. April Unboxers. Nope. Still have not made this page. Okay. Metronomicon. Okay. There's a blurb about the game on this side. This side. Over here. Oops, wrong one. This side, sorry. That's the game that came this month. That, um, I don't know if that's saying it's coming in next month's box, or if it's just a blurb from the manufacturer. Uh, game of Thrones map and marker. That's cool, that's the actual map they use in the show. Uh, Simpsons portrait, Digimon adventure figures. The watch is kind of cool. I don't know if I pay seventy dollars for watch. I tend to to break or lose those. Uh, Dragon Ball Z shifter knob, three D superhero lights, chomp chomp earrings. Those are kind of cool. Yeah, and if I get the collection off, there you go. Uh, Game Boy refrigerator magnets makes your fridge look like the original Game Boy. Dragon cake pan looks like a dragon egg nest or dragon nest. Mario Kart coasters, those are kind of cool. Looks like the power-ups. And then we've got the Instagram people, who I may have to try and get on Instagram with this. Uh, but that is the Geek Fuel box for this month. I will be getting the um, Firefly crate shortly, I hope. Hopefully it doesn't take too long to arrive. I did get this in the mail along with it, unrelated, but Geeks Have Beards too, obviously. So I'm going to try this out, I'll let you all know how it goes. I might do a review on this because I use actually a couple different beard products. It is Wild Willy's Beard Butter. I got the cool mint scent, actually it smells really good. So, uh, if you want to check that out, their website's pretty cool. Um, this is my, this is the end of the unboxing. I hope y'all like this video. Please follow me. If you do not already, invite your friends to follow me. I'm trying to build up my channel. And the more followers I get, the more cool stuff I'll be able to do. So I will see you all again. Well, you'll see me again <laughs> soon. Uh, when that Firefly crate comes in, it's going to be, um, Jane Cobb, who you might know him as, he's on the Baldwin Brothers, he played Casey on Chuck, and a bunch of other stuff. Um, hope you enjoyed my video, and again, just subscribe and, and like and share my video. Thanks.